All right, everybody, I'm here for your monthly market update as we look at our Edmonton, St. Albert, surrounding areas market. So uh, first off, I want to thank all of you for all your support. I got nominated for a cool nomination here in St. Albert or one of the top um, realtors. So um, yeah, it's Community Votes website. So been nominated and if you've nominated me, I really appreciate it and we'll see how it all turns out. So it's a Community Votes website. I'll probably have a link on my social media or on my website somewhere where you can Google St. Albert Community Votes and look under Realtor and uh, that goofy Kevin Machado guy's in there and you can always give him a nomination if you like. So uh, that's a really cool thing and I'm very thankful because it's all because of you, all my amazing clients. This is why I'm here to help serve you. And now in serving you is giving you information, uh, the information that you need to make wise decisions. So uh, what we're walking into here is a bit of a different market, right? Our market has been shifting as our interest rates have been rising and demand has pulled back and inventory is rising. And so we've got all of these factors that are making an impact on our market. So some of these numbers that we're looking at. So our average single family price has come down about 4% month over month. Month. We're still up almost 2% year over year. We've come down to $469,000. So we've seen that price retreat over this year. It's come down a bit. And uh, with these interest rates rising, again, another 0.75% we just saw, it's, it's going to have some impact on that pricing. So that means our prices are probably going to come down a little bit more potentially, um, depending on how the next interest rate hike might go. But we're going to see these prices kind of hovering in and around here, maybe coming down a little bit more. And our, for our months of inventory, so that's a big uh, earmark that we look at when we're trying to figure out how our market is going. Is it a seller's market or is it a balanced market or a buyer's market? Now, uh, seller's market is gonna be anything under four months of inventory. A balanced market is four to six, buyers, anything above. Currently, we're at 4.3 months of inventory. So that puts us right inside a balanced market, which means equal opportunity for sellers and buyers. That means buyers, you're going to see more homes coming on the market. You're going to have a little bit more opportunity to make some deals on homes and uh, hopefully get a better pricing. Sellers, this means you're going to have to be more competitive, that there's more options, there's fewer buyers for more homes, and those prices, you're going to make sure that you're in line with the market or even slightly below so you can generate that interest that you need to sell your home as quick as you can for that top dollar. And as we look at our days on market, when we look at how long the average property is staying on market for those single family homes, you're at 37 days on market. That's up a little bit from last year at 35, but you're at 37. So you're taking just over a month for the average home to sell. Um, and uh, yeah, so those are your important numbers. So your pricing, your days on market, and the type of market that you are in. So what does this mean? It means that you've got to make wise decisions. As you're looking forward as a seller, you need to make sure your property is ready. Get it looking really good. Have someone walk through and give you ideas on things to make it look better or little fixes that can add $5,000 to your value. Maybe it's painting or changing a door handle or, or fixing a hole in a wall. All very important things to do. And buyers, what you need to do is get pre-approved. Get a rate locked in so that you know what you're going to be spending and how that monthly fee, that monthly payment is going to look so that you're not going to be surprised with any sort of increases or anything like that. So sellers, get ready. Buyers, get ready. And in our general market, again, this is something that we're going to see. We're going to see some changes happen over the next couple months, but there's still great opportunities in this market, but you need to be wise and make the right decisions. So I hope this information is helpful. And again, thank you so much to all of you, all my friends, my, my clients for, for your support. It means the world to me. So have a wonderful day and we'll talk again soon. Bye-bye.